Hey, welcome back to the Sixth Gear Garage. Today, I'm taking this old steel wheel from a 1970s BMW 5 Series and turning it into this, right here in my garage. This whole wheel is in poor condition. The chrome cap, the emblem, and the rim itself is rusty from 40 something years of exposure to the elements. There's some more rust. Time for some electrolysis to remove the rust. This method uses electricity to remove rust from metal while it's submerged in water. And a battery charger is perfect for this. I have a full video on this process. Link is in the description. There's before electrolysis and there's after. I did the other half of the wheel. Now I'll sandblast it. The back is looking better. and the front. I'm keeping this video short since I already have a full length wheel restoration video that explains each step in detail. I'll put a link to that one in the description. I'm going to hit it with this VHT rust converter and this product is good for any light rust that's left on the wheel. It goes on clear, but what it does is chemically convert the rust into a black paintable primer. It's good for light rust, but not heavy scaling. And that's what it does. Now this is ready for paint. This is good stuff. I'll put a link in the description. I've got some self etching primer, perfect for going over any bare metal. Get the bead area as well, where the tire mounts. I'll put a link for the self etching primer in the description as well. It's been about 15 minutes, time for a second coat. And done with the back. I'll let this dry and do the same on the front. I'm using Dupacolor's wheel coating. This is the graphite, which is like a dark silver. I've always had good luck with this stuff. I'll have a link in the description. Wet paint looks so good. Well, if this cures, let's go take care of the center cap and trim ring. First, let's see what comes off with some soapy water. This sticker is yellowed and delaminating from 40 or so years of sun and weather. I'm not even going to try and save this.
I've tried Dugon and Heat without much luck. Let's see if Prep Spray will break down this old glue. The Germans don't mess around when it comes to adhesives. Finally. I don't know what this stuff is, but the prep spray softened it up a little. Let that sit for a while. First I tried some chrome polish. That didn't do much. So I busted out some mother's wheel polish and that made a big difference. I've always had success with Mother's Polish. Link for that is in the description. I got a new OEM emblem here. Special thanks to Tice Motorsport for getting this to me. Check out TiceMotorsport.com for all your genuine BMW parts. Link to their site is in the description. It has that metallic base just like the old one. Just peel and stick. Yep, it's the right one. I spent all that time polishing these with the mothers. It's already getting smudged up. I like to put a coat of wax on wheels, just a yellow carnauba paste. Mine's a little crumbly because it's 20 plus years old. I'll put a link to some fresh stuff in the description. Just wax on. I still had a little mother's left on there. And get a clean cloth and wipe off the haze. There you go. Back into your home. So, which one should I refinish next? See anything you like? Let me know down in the comments, and I'll see you in a future video. Thanks for watching, and consider subscribing for more how to videos and project vehicle updates here at the Sixth Gear Garage.